Hey guys, welcome back. Mass Effect 2, Disturbed 1, and this is episode 13? Yeah, 13. And the last episode was just this little 9, 10 minute video, and it was awesome because I was flying this badass car around jumping on shit. It's pretty cool. Alright, I'm gonna go get us a Krogan. This mission is a fucking bitch, too. If it's what I'm thinking it is. I need to go to a fuel depot. Alright, we got gas. Now we're gonna recruit us at Krogan. Corlus. Little bitty planet. Enter orbit. Land. Alrighty, we got we got homie G over here with Oh yeah, his cycle the parents looks a lot better. And we got this crazy, crazy woman. But I'm going oh shit. I'm gonna keep his cycle. Am I gonna put her back to original? Nah, I like her having red and black. Uh, nope, didn't get enough. Didn't get enough. Didn't get enough. Yes, I need to fucking change this stupid ass. There we go. Got my art projector back. The dossier doesn't say if Okir is on this planet by choice. Assume hostiles. There is only one measure of success. Kill or be killed. No right. Orders over loudspeaker. Classy. Stay focused. We're looking for a Krogan warlord. We're looking for a Krogan warlord? Holy shit. I never realized the dude was a Krogan warlord. <gasps> oh my gosh. Whatever will we do. Oh no. I got overload. Actually, I won't put that there. I don't want to put that there. Look out post ahead, and they're ready for us. Uh oh. Uh oh, spaghettios. Oh, that was fucking vicious. Cloaking. Yeah, go kill him. Come on, get over the wall, you dumbass. Wounded Merc. Okay, I'll talk to you. Shit. Shit. I won't stop bleeding. Suck it up, soldier. I've seen worse. He doesn't need to know that. I knew it wasn't Berserkers. Ah, not at range. You're Mercs. Or Alliance. I'm not... I'm not telling you anything. You're not in the best bargaining position. I'm looking for a Krogan named Okir. Who? <laughs> you already know more than I do. I just kill Krogan. The old one in the lab dumps crazy ones down here all the time. Jador hired him to make her an army, but the Krogan he creates are insane. So we use them for live ammo training. It's all crap. I don't get paid enough to goddamn bleed out. Outpost 4, Jador wants us to move. We need coordinates on that Krogan pack. You heard the man on the radio? He needs direction. I... I don't have the info they want. You showed up before I could get my normal sightings. You have other problems. Patrol, uh, uh, pack sighting east of Station 2. Yeah. Copy. East of 2. Son of a bitch. They'll run blind into Krogan. Have you seen Okir? Does he know about all of this? We can't go in the labs, but everyone sees what happens when the Krogan come out. I've shot hundreds. They're crazy, mindless. Anyone up there, they know what's going on. What's Jador planning to do with all these Krogan? Replace us, probably. I sure wouldn't want to see an army of them coming at me. Only she can't control them. They aren't supposed to be crazy, but they're Krogan. How smart are they to start? Is Jador's lab heavily guarded? There are big guns to keep ships away. We're not outfitted to fight goddamn commandos. 
If you start limping now, you might find a shady spot before you bleed out. Shit. Oh, shit. Oh. He just about pissed himself. Some people need a heavy hand. Come on. Our warlord is somewhere in Jador's lab. All right. It's part of your contract. Failure to perform means liquidation, legal and otherwise. <coughs> this is a bitch, by the way. It's Krogan or some kind of a son of a bitch to fight. Like, you guys have seen me fight like one or two at a time right now. Trust me, they get a lot fucking harder than that. <laughs> You get like eight Krogan charging at you with shotguns. <coughs> hey, fuck you, bitch. Get smacked in the face with the warp. <coughs> On my way. On my way. Yeah. Actually got a headshot, nice. Oh shit. Fucking missile. That had to hurt. Oh fuck. Fuck that prick. Sorry about that guy's phone, Ryan. Going to cover. Oh! Fire. 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 Just for good leisure. Alright, now I need ammo. Damn it. There we go. Where? Oh shit, Krogan. Oh shit. I right, got you, bitch. I gotta kill this Krogan though? That I don't know. Tank grown Krogan? different new you don't smell like this world seven night cycles and I have felt only the need to kill but you something makes me speak that thing's only a week old he must know something about all this if he survived this long survive yes I must survive but not here not against these fleshy shapes I must survive the enemy that threatens all my kind. But I failed, even before leaving Glass Mother. That is what the voice in the water said. That is why I wait here. You're supposed to be part of a mercenary army. Do you remember Jador? I know that name. It causes anger, but also laughter. It is not a name that will be sung when we march. I don't know what that means. But I have heard it many times. How can you speak if you're only a week old? There was a scratching sound in my head, and it became the voice. It taught things I would need. Walking, talking, hitting, shooting. Then the voice said I was not perfect, and the teaching stopped. And now I am here. So he's not good enough? For what? I don't know, but I am not perfect. Okir's voice? Did he speak to you while you were in your tank? I heard the voice. Not like now, with ears. Inside. I called it Father. It liked that. But it was disappointed. I'm not what it needs me to be. A lab full of Krogans. Probably trying to cure the genophage. Cure? Cure was never whispered. Survive, resist, ignore. How did you disappoint the voice? I don't know. 
It was decided before I left Tank Mother. I was not perfect. Maybe spending his week-long childhood in a tank made him crazy, like that Merc said. I don't know of that, but I'm not perfect. Can I get a refresher on the effects of this thing? A bioweapon deployed centuries ago to sterilize Krogan females. It's the reason the Krogan haven't overrun the galaxy yet. Can you show me the laboratory? I need to speak with Okir. The... Glass Mother. She is up, past the broken parts, behind many of you fleshy things. I will show you. Yeah, yeah. Krogan's are strong. We get it. I love that dude. You fleshy things are slow when big things are in your way. Can you show us the way? Help us fight to the lab? No. Hey, we let you out. A little gratitude? I will fight if they come. But I feel it deep that I must wait. I kill, but only here. I am not perfect, but I have purpose. I must wait until called. Released. I like that guy. He's a nice a guy. Of room to maneuver. Keep it together. They're loose. Run for your damn life. They're all free. <clears throat> what the fuck? <clears throat> wow, that was about a bitch. Can't do that right now. Can't die for me. I heard a Krogan. Good thing pistols are good against Krogan. Co-authorize that Krogan release, okay? Get ready. Time to die. Oh fuck. Smoking. Time to die. Oh, I love that she can do that. I see them. Ready to die. Where's he at? Going dark. God, she does so much fucking damage. Can't hide from me. Freaking ran out of bullets. Oh my gosh. Run away, run away. Well then, that went well. Yay, shotgun damage. Too bad I don't use shotguns. Alright, circuit. Well, that was easy enough. Not actually sure what's in here, but... This is valuable. Uh, oh, ammo. Alright, I'm full. Heads up. No! Oh, uh. Go, go! First aid. 
Missile. Oh. It's kind of funny. Down you go. <laughs> Taking cover. Feel the target. Can't do it. Going dark. Fuck you, bitch. Contact. Firing an impact shot. Can't do that right now. Fall back. Oh shit, Gasmate's like right there. Did she just kill them all? What the hell? Wow, Casimir just destroys shit. And there we go. Four thousand credits. Oh shit. Dodge the missile. Shit. Oh my gate my I jumped over the gate. Oops. <laughs> I'm gonna sit here so I don't fucking die. Now you see me. She is so fast. Down you go. Berserkers are going down, but the outsider commandos are still incoming. Repeat, still incoming. Going down. Man, this is an intense mission. Dodged it. What do you mean the door is holding the match? She'll lose all our toys if we don't get back up. Get you, bitch. Oh, ammo. Yay, I've got bullets back. I love this pistol. What's up here? Uh-oh. Come on. <laughs> That's 
move, move, move. Oh, I think I'm getting there. Remember this part. Now you see me. I died here a whole fucking bunch. This will put him down. This will bring him down. On my way. Somebody died, cast me. Oh, Kasim is up there. Get the ammo. Well, oh, Krogan. 4,000 credits. That was quick. Oh wow. Oh, okay, never mind. Here you are. I've watched your progress. It's about time. The batteries on these tanks will not wait while you play with these idiotic mercs. Not the smartest way to greet the heavily armed group that just kicked in your door. I'm sure whoever sent you doesn't want me dead. No one looks for me without a motive. Certainly not the deceased Shepherd. Surprised. All Krogan should know you. Or have you forgotten your actions on Vermeer? I'm sure you're eager to retell the story. Such a tale. Saren, the Spectre Traitor, threatens the return of the Krogan Horde by curing the Genophage, undoing the gentle genocide of the Turians and Salarians. But before Saren can deliver his endless troops, Inrod Shepard, securing victory through nuclear fire. I like that part. It has weight. I make no apologies. It was the most efficient solution. But I approve. Saren's pale horde were not true Krogan. Numbers alone are nothing. The mistake of an outsider. One that these mercenaries have also made. I gave their leader my rejects for her army. But she grows impatient. It's time for you to take me out of here. We're not here to help you, jackass. We're here about the Collectors. I see. Yes. Collector attacks have increased. A human concern. My requests were focused elsewhere. I acquired the knowledge to create one pure soldier. With that, I will inflict upon the Genophage the greatest insult an enemy can suffer. To be ignored. Your search for the perfect soldier created a lot of failures. You don't care about them? I failed no one. My rejects are exactly what Jador asked for. She simply lacks the ability to command. They are strong, healthy, and useless to me. I need perfection. 
If a few thousand are rejected, so be it. My work will purify the Krogan. We will not be restored. We will be renewed. You're just as cruel and manipulative as those who released the genophage on your people. Perhaps. But I will restore the Krogan, and my soldier will not provoke a nuclear response as a cure or horde would. My legacy is perfection, with each pure Krogan reaching higher by standing on our dead. They will exceed, but not forget. What did you get from the Collectors? I need whatever you know about them. They are strange, so isolated, yet very available when your sacrifice is big enough. I gave them Mini Krogan. I may have information for you, but the tech was consumed in my prototype, after I determined how to use it without killing the subjects. The deaths were unfortunate, but I only need one success to start the process. So you don't want to cure the Genophage? Contrary to what survivors claim, the Genophage does not produce strong Krogan. The only quality it filters is the ability to survive the Genophage. For every thousand stillborn, too many weaklings live. Every survivor is branded as precious. That's produced more cuddling than your collective human teats. I say, let us carry the genophage. Let a thousand die in a clutch. We will defeat it by climbing atop our dead. That is the Krogan way. I'm getting you out of here. Cerberus has interrogators who can figure out if you're useful or not. Any group that's spent enough to rebuild you won't care what it does to me. Perhaps we can strike a deal. One that secures my prototype. It is key. Attention! I have traced the Krogan release. Oh, here, of course. That weak will. She'll kill my legacy with a damn valve. Shepard, you want information on the collectors? Stop her. She'll try to access contaminants in the storage bay. Sorry, Doctor. It appears your position has just weakened. I understand. But you'll have nothing if she poisons us all. Jador will be with the rejected tanks. Kill her. I will stay and do what must be done. Alright, that was a long ass fucking cutscene. I have a feeling this is gonna be another 20, 30, 40 minute video. Whatever though. Huh. Fuck. Damn it. Well, there weren't that couple thousand. This way. Oh, what the fuck? Someone shut that bitch up. Yeah, I like you, Zee. You talk. I do like him. He's a sarcastic oh, motherfucker. This world is mine. Fuck you, bitch. Oh, Where the fuck am I getting shot Go from? Ahead. Destroy. I will rebuild. Ah, can't get down here. Hide on my world. Cloaking. Come on, bitch. Let's go. Oh, I missed. <clears throat> 
Oh wow, are you serious? It went between her fucking legs. It fucked cunt. What the fuck is he shooting at? Oh. Lights out. You got it. Alarms in the lab. This just keeps getting better. Shepard, the lab alarms coincided with the system's failure. The remaining lab systems are unprotected, and I have gained limited access. According to lab scanners, the room is flooded with toxins and Okira's personal life signs are failing rapidly. I recommend haste. Great. We get to run back up. Detected. Emergency vent in progress. Contamination detected. Emergency vent in progress. Is this the right room? If I knew why the collectors wanted humans, I would tell you. But everything is in my prototype. My legacy is pure. This one soldier. This grunt. Perfect. After all he's done, he was willing to die to save this thing? Must be valuable. A bullet in the brain would save us a lot of headaches. Do we need the trouble of a pure Krogan? The normal ones are hardly team players. We won't even know until he's out. And at that point, it's too late. Normandy, Okir is a no-go, but we have a package that needs retrieval. And he's a big one. Alright guys, that was the end of this episode. I'll see you next time.